Hey Taurus, welcome to your 16th to the 30th April love and general reading. This is going to be for Taurus Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. And quick announcement, I am doing $10 readings. But let's go ahead and hop right into the video. So the card that we got is leadership. This card says, whatever a great man does, common men follow. And whatever standards he sets by exemplary acts, all the world pursues. Okay, fuck yeah. So leadership, this is pretty self-explanatory here for the month. Um, people are looking up to you, man. I feel like some of you guys definitely do have Aries in your chart as well. But um, people see that you are walking your talk. They want to follow you. They want to learn from you. And they trust you, okay? So this is where actions speak louder than words. And um, people see you, Taurus. Um, I want to say be careful with your decisions once again. Because um, it does affect the people around you. But I do see that you are going to be making better decisions here. And um, people are going to recognize you. So let's go ahead and see what the rest of your spread is. We have the Five of Wands, Queen of Pentacles reversed, Justice reversed, Six of Pentacles, the Furlet, which is Temperance. Princess of Pentacles. Alright, Taurus, here's what we got from the 13th to the 30th of April. Um, so the signs that I'm seeing are a Libra and a Sagittarius. The Libra is showing up in the reverse, that's all I'm going to say, okay? So the Libra, there's a Libra here that's thinking about offering something to you, okay? Or maybe offering something to a Sagittarius. If this is you as the Princess of Pentacles, Taurus, then I'm seeing you thinking about offering something to a Sagittarius to keep the peace, or vice versa here, okay? But I feel like there's somebody here that has done you wrong, or you them here, and I'm seeing somebody just trying to make it up okay because in the mid month we start off with the five of wands this is um this is pettiness this is arguments and the thing that's standing out to me most is that rooster is that chicken like he's minding his own business he's eating so this to me is just letting me know that whatever complications that you have it's really nothing like you're just turning it into something 
or other people are trying to turn it into something bigger than what it actually is okay and it could have to do with your resources it could have to do with um, your finances here some people could feel like you were giving more to other people here things are unbalanced I feel like people think that um, you're hiding money or that you're giving it to other people or that you're only giving it to um, people that you want to I'm also getting here that people may be fighting for your attention as well or if you find yourself in a situation where you have to beg for somebody else's attention that's gonna cause drama for you and everybody else here um, so watch out for that is what I'm seeing with the Queen of Pentacles in the reverse some of you guys are not taking care of your health I feel like some of you guys are not taking care of your children I don't know why that came up um, and your finances as well I'm seeing health and finances um, not being too good here some of you guys may be being really stingy or just um, I'm seeing some of you guys here may be asking other people for money and not really coming from yours is what I'm seeing here or vice versa, okay? I'm sorry, or vice versa here can go both ways. But whenever I see temperance, um, this to me is a person who, when there's fights going on, let's say you have a fight with someone a few hours or a few minutes later the person can be like oh okay can i see the remote to the tv like nothing happened like a fight never happened someone who's staying in a situation um and yeah okay another thing that i'm seeing here too with um temperance is that some of you guys could be trying to be the peacemaker in this situation here some of you guys are um Either you or somebody else, I'm seeing a mother here, is trying to play it cool. I'm seeing, again, like health and stuff being ignored. Just, again, with temperance, just staying there like nothing happened. Um, so, listen to your body is what I'm saying here. Your children, um, your finances don't let it slide is what i'm getting here okay because we have justice in the reverse too justice in the reverse this talks about things being settled very unfairly this is lies this is um you know especially with the five of wands this is arguments and stuff and we have the princess of pentacles upright instead of the queen of pentacles um upright so there is an element of um, childishness. I'm not trying to call you guys out too because I know it, it gets hard sometimes, man. I understand that. But this is definitely what wants to come out here for you guys. So make sure you are looking at situation from both sides, not letting things slip, not um, overgiving or not... Um, you know begging people for money and things like that okay yeah I'm seeing a child I'm seeing an earth sign child here that could be quite mischievous and they could be for some of you there's a child here that's trying to help you out is what I'm getting here this could even be a, a dog or a cat um, if you don't have children if you have pets there's someone here who's trying to help you and they see that um, you're having a hard time. With justice in the reverse, there could be a divorce, 
There could be um, a breakup here, and I'm seeing that the Sagittarius keeping the kid is what I'm getting here. Or there could be a Sagittarius that's acting um, childish, not wanting to settle things. But as far as like legal stuff goes, I see things being very unfair here, especially if it has to do with money and with kids. Okay, so let's go ahead and pull an oracle card for advice for you guys. So you guys got TikTok. Your prosperity is co-created by your endeavors as they occur in human ma made time and the eternal efforts of your most important manifestation. Your prosperity is co-created by your endeavors as they occur in human made time and the internal efforts of your most important manifestation partner spirit in a divine measureless time so keep doing what you're doing stay positive and make the commitment to remain in high vibration thoughts and feelings if you heed the message of this card it will seem as if you will align with your highest calling and your highest good in no time at all like magic so what's all the fuss about not having enough time the prosperous life that is yours will never pass you by. Okay, Taurus, so that is all I have for you here. Um, again, $10 reading, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.